back once again with another Man of War rant. This video is on Evie Martell. Who is Evie Martell? Why is he significant? Why haven't I already addressed this? Let's start with the last point I made there. Why haven't I already addressed this issue? Well, I've been extremely busy with college. The last few months have just been a total shitstorm for me. And uh, yeah, that's just the general idea of things. So sorry about that. Evie Martell. Who is Evie Martell? Well, ladies and gentlemen, Evie Martell is now the new lead guitarist of Manowar, who will be joining the band on their 2019 leg of the Final Battle Tour. The question about who he is as a person is rather ambiguous. Evie Martell is relatively unknown. Now, in my last Manowar related video, I um, voiced my personal opinion on what routes Manowar could take to finding new guitarists. So just to recap, in the last video, I said Manowar could either bring back Ross the Boss slash David Shankle, find a new guitarist like they did with um, finding a new drummer, Marcus Castellani, bring back both of their old guitarists at once in a similar fashion to the Absolute Power 2005, or bring back Carl Logan if he is acquitted. However, that has not happened. So they got Evie Martell. Now, who is Evie Martell? Well, he's a little more closer to home for us Man of War fans than pe most people may realise. He is none other than the colleague of Marcus Castellani from uh, long ago, back in 2017 before Marcus Castellani joined Man of War. They played together in the official Man of War tribute band from Brazil, whose name I've forgotten. I think it's Kings of Steel. That might be a different tribute band, so don't quote me on it. But Evie Martell and Marcus Castellani both used to play in the only official Man of War tribute band licensed by Man of War, I believe. And so Evie Martell is well experienced in playing Man of War songs and just generally bringing the vibe that we're all used to. Joey DeMaio stated in a post that the Man of War official um, Instagram and Facebook page, I believe, uh, posted just after Evie Martell was brought into the band um, in the announcement that it's um, with great pleasure that he uh, announces Evie Martell's joining of the band he's ready to uh he's a picture of him holding his guitar like this like a weapon um and he's pleased to announce that he's ready to join the band and that he knows every man of war song to date now what do i think of this personally i fully support it wholeheartedly 100 percent. i think that david shankle and ross the boss would both have struggled to learn the new songs of man of war since their day in time more so with ross the boss because he hasn't been in man of war since 1988 so a full 40 years, 40 years, 30 years, a full 30 years worth of Man of War he has missed out on, and uh, 28 years, no, 18 years, hang on, and, and many much time for David Shankle, which would mean it would be difficult for him to learn all the new songs also. Um, so going for a man who already knows all the Man of War songs is already beloved by many of the fans for playing in the official Man of War tribute band, and has a flair for Man of War just as much as the fans do, it's probably the best thing they could have gone with, um, given the circumstances. So um, I wholeheartedly support it, and I think Man of War have made the right choice, the right decision, and quite frankly, I cannot wait to see Evie Martel play with them on stage in Birmingham 2019, which is where I will be going, uh, myself and Maddie, who I don't think has been on this channel yet, so um, you'll get to meet her. And I'm hoping to go to many more concerts soon with my Metalhead friends, and that as well as do some gigs with my band, um, which I'll put on here. Anyway, Marcus Castellani has got his old colleague back and Man of War have a new guitarist who knows all their songs. Uh, so quite frankly, I, again, I think this is the best decision they could have made and he is the best man for the job. Not only is he a fan, but he is a tried and tested guitarist that we fans love already. He, you know, if he was shit, we'd know by now. So... The fact that he's been able to endure, quite frankly, the sceptical ear and wrath of the Manor Warriors for this long in a tribute band proves to me that he's already the right man for the job. So, good choice, Man of War. Well done, Eric and Joey. Can't wait to see you all in Birmingham 2019. So please don't forget to rate, comment and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. My next video will be when I went to see Nightwish, which should be the first video I've made featuring myself and Maddie who is my uh, honorary and official gig buddy from now on. So, um, 
That's what you've got in store from me. Fuck the world, hail and kill.